I don't care. I'm a bird, mother. I'm a bird. The Nuvo is very mad at gamers. Yes, you guys. Yeah, you. You the one going? No, not me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you, right there. The one picking your nose, all of you. The Nuvo is mad at you. Okay. Stop scratching your butt for a second and think about the Nuvo and how upset they are with you. Sponsored. sponsored. No, I'm kidding. Myself. And today's stream is sponsored by the Nuvo. <laughs> <laughs> Allegedly. The <laughs> Nuvo is sick of toxicity. Says people only hate it because it works. This follows Denuvo getting all upset on their Discord. Some messages shared by Pirate Nation. This one from David at Denuvo saying, As someone who has to test pirated versions, pirated versions have their own issues, and you may catch actual malware and viruses. Also, there's little to no support. <laughs> they just get ratioed <laughs> by the clown. <laughs> Imagine you make a post on your Discord. And you get ratioed like that. <laughs> Especially with a statement like that. As someone who has to test pirate versions, pirated versions have their own issues. And you may catch actual malware slash. Who's interrupting me? <laughs> Who's interrupting me? As someone who has to test pirated versions, pirated. Versions have their own issues, and you might might catch actual malware slash virus. Also, there is a little to no support. Okay, let's break this down. I don't care. That's all. Viruses. Also, there is little to no support. They just get ratioed by the clown emojis. PC Games and talking about how the Nuvo's recently been trying to improve their public image, opening up a Discord server that was quickly shuttered following a tsunami of inappropriate content. Their new products manager, Ullman, then talked to RPS to say the team is sick of letting toxicity slide. <laughs> hey guys, they're sick of letting it slide. Watch out for the Denuvo police over here, saying they're gonna stop letting. You heard it here first. If you're toxic, the Nuvo is gonna pull up at your house and beat you up. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Gotta be honest, majority of the games that release this game genuinely don't support. Don't deserve support. Yeah. The game is pirated. The fact that there is any support is surprising. Quite often, the pirated versions allegedly. Allegedly. allegedly legal reasons all that blah 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 sh ding ding dang um they actually quite often have better support because the person who uh, is usually distributing the pirated versions again allegedly i don't know the bird i already told me that uh they actually put in more patches and code fixes into that version than the actual publisher slash developers yo, yo that's crazy every claim about their product go unanswered. On the now shuttered Discord, an FAQ page rejected claims that the Nuvo caused performance issues, directly addressing the Resident Evil Village and Tekken 7 controversies. Back in 2018, Harada himself talked about these issues in Tekken 7, going on to talk about frame rate drops, and that they're not an issue of graphics and CPU processing, and that the whole thing was a problem with the encryption program. Someone asked, what does the encryption program do? And Harada says, Anti-tamper third-party middleware. It's live updating programs, and I heard it's fixed soon from them. We will check it and update. Thanks. While the messages were a little vague, eventually Tekken 7 did end up removing there the you Nuvo go. on Steam. Returning to present time, it looks like Denuvo is still upset about that entire thing. They're full. Okay, so Denuvo genuinely need to shut the fuck up. They're dragging the performance of a game down because of which. The game can suffer bad publicity that it's quote-unquote performing badly. So you drop the Nuvo, and the Nuvo then throws a hissy fit? Good job, just imploding yourself. This is a good example of how about instead of running your mouth, you actually work on your product. Yep. Thank God running my mouth is my product. 
simple answer from the aforementioned FAQ is right here. What happened with Tekken 7 in 2018? They say, Tekken 7 experienced an issue where the wrong source code part was selected for protection. Specifically, it was triggered during specific moves by certain characters, leading to in-game stuttering. Normally, issues like this are caught by the game developer or publisher during the QA process and can be resolved by simply excluding the affected code part from the protection system. Tech for Gamers writing, Many gamers have not bought these rationales by Denuvo at all and have argued against using this software because of performance issues. And back at PC Games N, they write, Denuvo itself appears to take no blame for these issues. And when asked why the software has such a poor reputation, Ullman, that products manager, claims it's because our solution simply works. Pirates um. cannot play games which are using what? our solution over quite long time periods, usually until the publisher decides to patch out our solution. Ullman. He's so delusional. <laughs> he's, he's coping so hard that he's failing his company. A little birdie once whispered to my ear that <laughs> every game where the novel is involved is actually pirated pretty early on. <laughs> and quite often because otherwise the original one is pretty lagging. Claims there is a huge community of players who are not willing to part with the cash to play the games they want to, and therefore they have a lot of time to spend in communities and share their view and try to blame the Nuvo. Anyways. I just found that to all be pretty funny, and I hope you did too. Let me know what you think about that stuff in the comments. And if you enjoyed my brief coverage, please consider liking and or subscribing to the channel. Appreciate ya, and I'll see you video. Good video. Good video. But yeah, so the Nuvo needs to just shut the hell up and work on their product. The Nuvo is a laptop company, right? No, the Nuvo is an anti-pirating software component for games. If I remember correctly the nova is easily uh easy to remove a, a lot of people they won't even bother tinkering around with it right so they'll just go and get the pirated version which will result in the nova actively harming the game publisher this as an edit just for leafu's like introduction if i try to edit like that it might kill anyone that view it do it mike I will praise you if you if you do it. All right, but I'm gonna bloody hate you for this. And I'm strictly dickly. <laughs> You're not interesting. <laughs> Tits. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> Taught you shapes, you poor son of a bitch! <laughs> poor people don't know what squares are! My Skyrim <laughs> streams without me playing a Khajiit that walks around stabbing kids. <laughs> I mean, people. Would it be fun? No, it wouldn't be fun. Is it evil to do it? Yes. Is it fun? Hell yes. No. Why are you treating me like I'm weird? Okay, <laughs> okay. Cool context. I don't just walk around and, you know, shank a child. Okay, listen. <laughs> she called me a servant. Okay? And, <laughs> you know, I had to establish my dominance. Then I went to a village. They were acting like I'm some gross thing. So I had to lead the dragon there. How am I wrong? <laughs> okay, imagine if I would like <laughs> just, just play Skyrim, do the quest, no. don't do anything, right? Would it be fun to watch? No, exactly. That's what I'm saying. Think about it. Really don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, we got her. Just, just do it, Mike. I'm on it. <laughs>